So now it's important to note that before you start using the LUT Master FX drag and drop system in Final Cut Pro, you're going to want to install the LUT files. And to do that, it's very easy. So once you're inside Final Cut and you have any shot, you're going to go into your effects category and you're going to see your color category. And inside there, you're going to see the option for custom LUT. And all you want to do is drag and drop custom LUT onto any shot. And once you drag and drop, you're going to see over in the right hand corner in your effects control panel, the custom LUT. And you want to click on the LUT. And you can see I've already installed LUT Master and it's going to show all my categories here if I just scroll through. However, what you want to do in order to install is choose custom LUT. Now go in a Cine Punch, go inside your LUT Master Cube files, and inside there you're going to see your LUT Master folder. All you have to do is select that, hit open, and everything will be installed. So if you have Motion installed into your computer, all you have to do is go inside the Cine Punch folder, and we're going to see a folder for each category, effects, generators, transitions. So we have our transition punch, and then we have inside our generators our filmmaker and leak punch effects. And in our effects, we're going to have our disruption, our LUT master, and our filmmaker VFX effects uh, we're going to have to download. If you click on this PDF, you're going to have several servers for which you can download from. So once that's downloaded, just drag and drop this folder inside the effects folder. So now to install these into motion, inside your main drive, you're going to go to your users folder, go to your home, and inside your home, you're going to go to your movies folder. And inside your movies folder, you're going to see your motion templates. And inside there, you're going to see your effects, your generators, and your transitions. Now all we want to do is go back to our effects, generators, and transitions inside Cine Punch. So I'm going to go inside my transition folder here, and I'm going to take my transition punch, drag and drop it into the transitions folder inside Motion. Next, I'm going to go to my generators. I'm going to grab my leak punch and filmmaker generators and drag and drop them into the generators folder. And now I'm going to take my disruption, my filmmaker, and LUT master effects inside the effects folder, drag and drop them into the effects folder for motion. So to install your effects generators and transitions inside Final Cut, go to your Cine Punch Final Cut Pro Transitions Effects Generators folder. Inside there you're going to see your effects generators transitions folder. Now in order to access our effects, generators, and transitions folder for Final Cut, we want to go to our Applications folder, go to our Final Cut app, right-click, select Show Package Contents. Inside there, we're going to go to our Contents folder, our Plugins folder, go to our Media Providers folder, inside the Motion Effect folder, Contents folder, our resources folder, and then our templates folder. And once inside there, we will see our effects, generators, transitions folder. And all we want to do is now take our transition punch. So I'm going to go inside my transitions folder inside Cine Punch. I'm going to get my transition punch transitions, drag and drop them into my transitions folder. Now I'm going to go to my generators folder inside Cine Punch select my generators, drag and drop them into my generators folder, and then go into my effects folder. So please download the Filmmaker VFX folder. If you click on this PDF, you're going to have several servers for which you can download the effects folder from. So please download that folder. Now once that's downloaded, just drag and drop the Filmmaker effects folder inside this Cine Punch effects folder. So now I have my disruption, my Filmmaker, and my LUT Master effects. And all I'm going to do is drag and drop these three folders into the effects folder for Final Cut. Now once inside Final Cut, if I go up top to Window, Show in Workspace, I can select my transitions. And inside there you should see your transition punch. 
and you can scroll through and see all the different transitions here. If I go back, I'm going to go back up top to Window, Show in Workspace, now select Effects. So inside the Effects category, we have our Disruption Effects, Filmmaker Effects, and our LUT Master Effects. And we can just preview through these effects and see what it's going to look like on our shot. If I go over here to my generators, I can now see I have my leak punch generators, my filmmaker generators, and that's it. Enjoy. Enjoy.